guys if you are new to my channel then please subscribe it and click the bell icon to get the notification for upcoming videos thank you hello friends welcome back to another video of automation testing insider so today i'm going to talk about gui testing graphical user interface testing or you can say user interface testing so this is kind of functional testing guys so before i proceed further let's talk about what do you mean by user interface and what do you mean by gui graphical user interface so if you talk about ui so when when human being interacts with computer or any user interact with computer by any medium let's say we have mouse keyboard or touch screen when we interact with the computer that is nothing but the user interface so this is the interaction between user and the computer whereas gui when we interact with computer with the help of graphical elements let's say we have windows scroll bars buttons radio buttons images check boxes so these are graphical mediums when we interact with computer so that is nothing but gui so gui is the part of ui guys so gui is the part of user interface and ui could be different types user interface could be different types we have command line argument as well we have CLI command line uh, sorry command line interface so when we interact with command line so that is command line interface when we interact with menu driven menu driven mdi is another interface we have uh, screen reader as well screen reader so these are the different medium we interact with computer so as i have discussed gui is the part of user interface and uh, you can say in other words gui is subset of ui or you can say ui is superset of gui now what we uh, basically what we uh, test as part of gui testing so we test the front end whether all the elements are displayed properly or not as per given in the requirement whether uh, size of the image is correct or not whether font is correct or not uh, whether uh, we are getting the error messages proper uh, properly it is displayed or not or color of the fonts or uh, images has good clarity or not so these are the different uh, uh, testing we we uh, the different checklist we do as part of this gui testing guys so we will discuss more about that now we can perform gui testing in two ways we have manual testing and manually we can uh, perform it and through automation tool as well let's say we we can use selenium eggplant cucumber or test complete there are different tools we can verify ui or graphical user interface so let's talk about what is gui and we'll discuss more about it so ui testing also known as gui graphical user interface testing which we have discussed verify the page or window displayed or not so that is the main purpose of gui testing so here in gui testing we don't uh, care about the functionality firstly we see the whether look and feel are proper or not all the elements are properly uh, designed as per the given as per given in the requirement or not so that is the main purpose of ui testing or gui testing verifying the object displayed in the page this usually means testing the visual elements on the application so whatever elements are given in the uh, web page or application whether they are uh, as per the requirement or not so that is the main purpose of ui testing guys or gui testing now there is another testing term uh, usability testing usability testing so do not confuse usability with this gui testing because usability testing is different guys and gui testing is different basically in ui we mainly talks about the front end testing and usability uh, talks about the overall functionality of the application uh, look and feel how easy uh, to use that application so that is the main purpose of usability testing whereas ui testing we just see the look and feel all the elements are there or not we don't care much about the functionality in ui testing so that is the difference between usability testing and uh, UI testing. We'll talk more about usability testing uh, going forward as well. Now let's talk more about uh, GUI testing. 
So why we use user interface testing? So GUI testing is helps to deliver high quality and user friendly software. In the end, you achieve a higher level of user engagement and satisfaction. So that, that is the main purpose of user interface testing. So let's say if you give any application to the user and if that is not user friendly or if all the elements are not pro properly aligned or if it is not designed properly as per the requirement given so definitely the user will not satisfy the uh, satisfy with the application so they will reject it because that is not easy to use or uh, their look and feel is not proper so they will definitely they will reject the application so this is the main purpose of user interface testing whatever uh, the elements are there should be proper and it should achieve the higher level of user engagement with satisfaction to ensure the images uh, ensure the images and other feature are user friendly or not to ensure that user will use the application further or not so that is another uh, uh, another reason we go for gui testing what we verify as part of GUI testing guys. So in GUI, we mainly test the visible design element like button, icon, text box, etc. We check for the fonts are readable or not. Check for the images, their clarity and pixel size and the position of the image. Check uh, for the page if it is easy to understand as per customer point of view. So check for the buttons and boxes. Uh, check boxes are proper, are proper and not overlapped. So that is also part of GUI testing. So check for grammar and spelling in the page. Testing of the error messages that are getting displayed on the web page. So these are all uh, different types of uh, uh, part of GUI testing, guys. We verify all these stuff while doing the GUI testing. Testing the different sections of the screen. So let's say we have a web page and we have different menus in the web page. So we will verify all the sections are properly aligned and all the sections are properly uh, defined as per as part of requirements or not. Whether they are properly aligned, or whatever contains uh, each section has, whether they are properly uh, given as part of properly designed or not as part of requirements. So that is that is what uh, we verify as part of GUI testing. So what are the advantages of UI or GUI testing guys? So it helps validate the compliance of various icons and elements with their design specifications. The sooner we can catch uh, offending elements in our UI, the quicker they can be resolved. So offers developers and tester ease of use and learnings efficiently reduces the number of risks towards the end of development life cycle. So these are the different advantages of UI or GUI testing guys. Now let me just uh, show you. So this is orange HRM application guys. So as part of GUI, we'll verify the logo is proper or not on this. This is the orange HRM logo. So whether this is properly uh, aligned and properly the size of the pixel of this image is given uh, is designed properly or not. And uh, here we have username, password fields. And if you click on login, we should verify this user, the error message properly. Uh, displayed or not as per the given in the requirement we have uh, we check this link whether it is working when we click on this forget password link it should redirect to correct page or not and this is again orange hrm logo and here you can see hr for all so all the elements all the ui related things front end whatever is displayed on the web page or application we verify all as part of gui testing so this is all for today guys so if you have any questions then please write in the comment box and please like this video share it and if you are new to my channel then please subscribe it thank you so much have a nice day bye bye